Hi, this is Eric with Home Network Central, and I'm gonna show you how to reset your Edimax, I believe I said that correctly, your Edimax router to default factory settings. What this is gonna do is reset any password or any settings on here that are causing you to go rip your hair out or whatever. It'll reset everything just like you got it out of the box brand new from the store. So it's gonna take off any passwords, any settings, and just reset everything. Uh, first thing we're gonna do is make sure you're plugged into power. So I'm gonna plug this thing in. And we're gonna let it boot up. Now, normally, like 99% of the routers I've ever worked with, what you do is you go to the back or go to the bottom and there's a little reset button hidden inside of a hole and you gotta press a pin or a pencil or something inside of it. Um, this router, this particular one, I'm not sure if all Edimax routers are like this, but this one is. This one, we're gonna be holding down the WPS button. It says reset slash WPS. So we're gonna be holding that button down to reset it. So it's all booted up and on the instructions, what it says for this router is, you hold the button down until the internet light is flashing. Well, as you'll see here, my internet light is already flashing. We haven't even done anything. That's because I'm not plugged in the internet. So it's flashing because there is no internet, I'm guessing. So we're not gonna be able to really use that as a, as a cue. But basically what you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna go and hold down this button for at least 15 seconds. So Let's just go ahead. I'm gonna press this button in and I'm gonna hold it, this button. I'm gonna hold it in for at least 15 seconds. Starting now. 1001, 1002, 1003, 1004, 1005, 1006, 1007, 1008, 1009, 1010. Up, oh, you see it, now it's changing. So now I can let go of the button. So that was about 10 seconds. You just want to hold it down for at least 10 seconds. And what's going to happen now when I let go of that button is this router is going to restart and any passwords I have on there are going to be gone. Any settings are going to be gone and everything is going to be the factory default. And you can find that information on the back or on the bottom. If you look at the bottom on this particular router, uh, the default password and username and Wi-Fi and all that stuff is on the bottom. So all those settings will apply. Now, I don't know how many routers Edimax makes. I'm not too familiar with them, but I'm sure they have diff They all look different. Um, for the most part, normally routers, you look on the back, like this router over here, there'll be a reset button. It says reset and there's a little like a hole and it's like, what the hell, my button's missing. But there's not really a button missing. The button's inside there. You just gotta use a paper clip. So you basically just find that hole, press the paper clip in, and then push it down. And there's there's a button in there. You just gotta hold it down. So this router is a little bit different. It's got a button you actually press, but most routers, so if I'm just saying if you have an Edimax router and it's a different model than this, it might be different for you. You might typically this is how it works. You have this little hole with a button inside of it. And same thing, you hold it down for like at least 15 seconds and wait for the lights to change. And then it'll reset and you'll have new settings. So if this helped you out, please give me a thumbs up and thank you so much for watching.